This is a Predium from Elliot Williamson, Barham Forge. Thumb studs are removed because I was zeroing the primary grind. Challenge this week, a number of knife makers, including Murray Carter, have argued that the so-called brass rod test can be used to judge the heat treatment and the quality of steel of a knife. Now the way they do that is they take the knife, put it on a brass rod, press it down until the edge deflects, release the force, and if the edge returns to true, they say, well, the quality of the steel and heat treatment is okay, or at least not proven to be defective. If the edge stays bent or the edge chips, then there's a defect. Now I would assert that that test, as described, isn't meaningful. So the challenge this week is to explain why that's true or why it's wrong. Why the test is meaningful and you can actually reach that conclusion from that data. As always, you can ensure that you win not only by providing that correct argument, but also refuting an argument that someone else uses. So for example, if you're asserting that the test is meaningful, then you would refute the strong argument from someone who says that it isn't. As always, if you resort to any ad hominem attacks, then you're automatically disqualified.